Midnight, the artist behind the double platinum hit Mr. Big Stuff, has died. She was 80 years old. Now, the song's enjoyed by many generations, but what you might not know is it recorded right here in the capital city. Wolf Stevenson was there when Gene Knight recorded the hit back in 1971 at the original Malico Records studio, which was destroyed by a 2011 tornado. The New Orleans native arrived in Jackson accompanied by fellow artists and producers. He says Gene Knight was fun and a lively spirit who made work fun while also showing up prepared and professional. He recalls after the initial recording of her big hit that it took a while for the song to gain traction, but it wasn't until the success of Groove Me, as King Floyd's song there, shortly followed by Mr. Big Stuff, that things took off. Well, Gene was... Uh playing around in, in uh, performances and such like that. And she was very much at home in the studio. But she had a sense of humor that was just terrific. Uh, so it made it more like fun than work. Uh, her uh, rapport with the musicians was fantastic. Uh, she was very talented. But again, Wardell Kazair, the producer who had put all this together, he had gotten them so rehearsed that it just went off without a hitch. And uh, it, it took a while to get the product out and going, but once that happened, um, Wardell and Jean were both able to continue her career for quite a long time. Stevenson continued to work with Gene Knight on multiple projects. He added that if he could go back in time, the one thing that he would do different, and boy, I'd love to see this, is to take <laughs> more pictures during all of those sessions that he was not only with Gene Knight, but all the other ones out there at Malico. Man, that would have been a treasure. We